Imagine cracking a code with just a few guesses. Sounds cool, right? Today let's talk about equivalence partitioning. It's a fancy term but don't worry it's super simple. Think of testing a vending machine that takes RS1, RS2 and RS5 coins. Instead of testing every coin in existence you divide them into two groups, valid coins like RS1, RS2 and RS5 and invalid coins like RS10. You test one coin from each group. If RS2 works, great, and if RS10 gets rejected you're all set. This saves time but still catches the bugs. Now let's bring it to the digital world. For a password field accepting 6 to 12 characters, create valid and invalid groups. Test a password like 123456 for valid and 123 or 123456789012 for invalid. See? Equivalence partitioning helps you test smart, not hard. Happy testing!